What's going on YouTube? Jeans here, bring you guys part 4 for my playthrough on Pokemon Sword and Shield, the Isle of Armor. So guys, in the last episode, we actually evolved Cub Fu into Urshifu, the water and fighting type. And in today's video, I believe we're going to be finishing up this whole DLC story mode. So if you guys are hyped, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. Thank you guys for all the support that's been going out on this channel. But this is our team right now. I just have it stacked up with Lucario, Dragon Ball, Extra, Titar, Garros, and a level 75 Urshifu, which I am actually going to go give a uh, a nice little, uh, what is it called? Nice little potion. Just to get a start here. Let's give it a max other too. There you go. Give that to that. And we'll, uh, what are we going to get back? Go with Ari Aerial Ace. We'll go with Aerial Ace. And I got to use an Ether on, uh, I should just, uh, no, we're fine. We're fine with that. And then I just give it a potion like that. But yeah, I believe we are going to be finishing up this playthrough because someone told me that I only have two more parts left. I have to go visit Hop, help him with the max mushrooms, and then face off with Mustard one last time. And then supposedly you unlock like a secret island. I'm not too sure how it works, but hopefully we can figure it out today. <gasps> and yo, we, it's raining. It's raining. I think Polytoads spawn here. Do Polytoads spawn here? I have Polyworld. I have Polyrath. I have Poly, uh... No. <gasps> there he is! And I have Polywag. But, bro, here's Polytoad. I need this dude. Thank God it is raining. I was looking for this guy, and I cannot wait to show off Polytoad in some ranked or not ranked or some casual battles for right now. I have a bunch of teams lined up for you guys so I can show them off and all that good stuff. But if you guys want to actually help me build teams... Hit me up on my Instagram page, jeans underscore YouTube. DM me over there. But, yo, I want to help build teams. Build me some new teams with Pokemon that I haven't uh, used yet. Some of the new Isle of Armor Pokemon. So, I just used an Urshifu team already with Talonflame. I got an Alakazam team on the way. And I have a Kingdra Polytoad team. So if, so, if anybody wants to make me, like, a Luxray team. Or, like, I'm trying to think. Who else? Who else is there? Like, a Scizor team. Just some cool new Pokemon. Like and Rock. Something like that. Hit me up on my uh, Instagram page. If you guys do not have Instagram, just uh, comment in the comments section down below. Let me know. That you want to make me a team. But let's go. We got to catch this thing. I cannot even hit it right now. Uh, do I hit it with an aerial ace? I'm going to hit it with a brick break if we wake up. You wake up Urshifu. Urshifu. But this thing is an absolute beast in some uh, in the VGC. Like, dude, it rips. It absolutely rips. If you guys haven't checked out that video, go back. It was the last video that I posted. We dominated. We absolutely dominated that video. Do not kill it. Thank you. Bring this Polito down to, like, red. And he hits us with a pound. Like, what, what kind of moves that you got? But yes, I need him for my Pokedex. And if you guys want to catch out my streams or check out my streams, link will be in the description below. G25 on Twitch. I believe uh, in the most recent streams that are coming up, where me and the viewers are going to be trying to complete the Pokedex by trading and giving Pokemon that we do not have so we can complete the Isle of Armor Pokedex. So if you guys are interested in that, go down there, hit that follow button, turn on notifications. We got this thing down the red. Come on, catch it. Yes, sir, this is it. This is it. Give me the clicks. Yes, sir. Get Politoed up in our Isle of Armor Pokedex, which is beautiful. But like I said, we're going to go over to Hop. Go check him out. Get him the max uh, mushrooms and all that so we can do his research on all that good stuff. Then I think we just have to face Mustard one last time. So I am told. So I am told. But let's go get Hop. Where's Hop? Malmar spawned. So it's like a bunch of whole new Pokemon going to be spawning. Uh, do I have to go this way? Actually, where is Hop at? Let me check the map real quick. Let me check the map. I kind of forget what's going on without not going on like the the routes and everything. Yeah, we gotta go up this way. To the forest of focus where we call it Amoongus and all that. And I believe like episode one or two of this uh, DLC playthrough. But this one might be the finale. Cool thing we did catch Polytoad. Bro, I just felt like a wicked sneeze coming, but it didn't happen. Oh, there's Hop. Right here, this is where we want to go. Yo, what's good, Hop? We gotta find you some max mushrooms. What's he gotta say? What's good? Dude, I feel a sneeze coming. I don't even know. Finally, Jeans, I've been waiting forever for you. I thought Glenwood Tangle was real maze, but this place is entirely different, and it's so hot and humid that I'm sweating a pond over here. Tony and I split up place, places to survey, and she opted for the cold and the snow and all. <gasps> Speaking of cold and snow, that is probably the uh, Crown Tundra. That sounds amazing. So what does he want us to do? All I saw was like Lilganth or something. What does he say? I reckon Lilganth and Appen are most likely Pokemon to produce any nectar here. And then force to focus. Let's see if they uh if they can't spare a bit for Urshifu. So I have to catch uh Lilganths and uh Appens? Oh hey, this is uh this is what I gotta get. Come here. Come here, boy. So I guess I gotta find the Appen and this thing. Well this one's done. I don't know what it's gonna do. Come here, look, it's Patil. Patil evolves into Lilganth, which is just the Pokemon we're looking for. Pet. <laughs> oh my god, dude. I've been loving the Isle of Armor. Hey, doesn't that Patil seem like it's been acting strange? Yeah, I guess. It's just doing its own thing. 
looks sort of sad. Let's go, hop. Get it. Get it, yo. I'm ready to actually finish up this uh, story mode so I can actually visit everything and collect all the Pokemon and get back into the rank ladder and stuff. Or just casual battles because I have a blast doing that, especially with new Pokemon. But, Patil, what's good? Now do I have to find Appwin? I have to find Appwin now? Appwin, where you at? Appwin, where you at? Let me check uh, if the map says what I have to do. Is it to say find Appwin and Patil? Take Lilith to where Patil is. Take Lilith. I thought that... Okay. We gotta, we gotta take him to where Patil is. Is Hop following me? Come here. Come here, Hop. Hold on. I'm trying to figure everything out. Lilith is a Pokemon that's got a big fire blooming on its head. You can't miss it. And one to find its way. Anyway, right? We're catching two Rookadees with one ball. Wait, what? Huh? I'm so confused. Where's Lilgant at? Where's Lilgant? I thought Lilgant was like out there somewhere. There's a bunch of uh, Venipedes. Where is Lilgant? We have to find it. He said we can't miss it. Giant flower on its head. I think we can miss it. Oh my lord. That thing's sick. I love that Pokemon. A little bit sharp. I'm going to hop on my bike make things quicker. All right. So now, where the heck is Lilgant? I'm trying to find it. I cannot find it. Bro, what's up, Crawdon? But yeah, I've been having a blast with this uh, DLC playthrough, but I'm ready uh, for the story mode to kind of be over. Can I talk to you again? Are you going to say the same thing? Not you, Patil. No, not you, Patil. Come here, hop. <laughs> Why do I keep talking to Patil? Come here. All right, now where is Logan? With the giant flower on its head. I'm looking. I thought Logan spawns out here. Maybe, maybe not. No, it's got to be in the forest of focus. All right, let's just keep searching the, uh, this place right here until we find... Uh, Lilligant. -na 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 -na. Where you at, Lilligant? Where are you at? Yeah, yeah. Oh, there's a little TM over there, but I don't really need it too, too much. There are just TRs here. They just spawn randomly. I don't think I've been on this side. Unless I'm back to where I started. There's Pikachu. Hello, Pikachu. How you doing? Leaf Zone. Not bad, not bad. Okay, so we found the Leaf Zone. Let's keep grinding here. Let's keep grinding, trying to find this thing. He says we can't miss it. I, th I think it's got to be another Pokemon just like that. So I'm going to keep heading this way. And this has got to be it, right? Yep. Found it. Big old flower on her head. What's good? Uh, let's talk to her. We got a little cutscene going on. She's going to say, like, probably, like, Lila. Lila Gant. <laughs> Let me go talk to this thing real quick. We got Patil. We found him. I like how these things understand English. But we don't understand him. It's weird. <laughs> but there we go. We bring Lila Gant back to Hop. Wait, what just happened? Oh, no. She's with us. Now we got to bring her back. Will you follow me if I'm on a bike? Yes. Come on. Yes, sir. Let's go. This way. This uh, Force of Focus is actually rather bigger than you would think it is, you know? It's a lot bigger than you think it is. Come on, little game. I don't know if I keep going forward, she'll, uh, she'll fall behind. But we'll see. We'll see. I'll keep an eye out. I'll keep an eye out. Oh, yeah. She definitely falls behind. I got to like, keep up close. Yo, get back here. Come on. This way, girl. This way, girl. <laughs> she totally falls behind, which is kind of funny. And Urshfu's just like speeding up with us. Right, which way did I come from? I'm, I'm lost in this woods. No, it's this way. It's this way. No, it's not. No, it's not. Logan, we're back this way. Come on. Come on. All right, I see that uh, red beam, so I believe this is the way we came from. We go this way. And then up to the right. Where you at? Come on. This way. Onward. <laughs> and then around here, because I remember that big old boy. What's his name? Is that Skullpeed? And then let's go this way. What the heck was that? Just spawn. That was Pikachu. <laughs> it was Pikachu. Yes, over this bridge and then to the right, I believe. And then to the right. Yeah, Hop should be right chilling over here. Come on, little Gant. I'm getting real tired of you being all slow. Can't you run like Urshifu? And over this way. Nope. I think I went the wrong way. Bro, I'm lost. I'm lost. <laughs> Just trying to find my way out. There it is. This way. I see that red beam. I think that leads back to the beginning. Or was I just over here? No, I'm gonna trust my I'm gonna tr trust my instincts here, Bruh. Is it this way? It's one of these red beams. We'll actually follow it, bro. This is such a pain. Where's Lil again? <laughs> no, where did I lose her at? She's on the bridge. <laughs> Alright, hello, Lil Gant. Okay, so we're here. We I gotta bring you all the way back. You're such a pain. This is such a pain. Why can't you run like Urshifu? Let me take a look at the map. See if I can uh map it out for myself or i don't think it does anything no it doesn't even help us but i gotta get to a bridge it's, it goes across the bridge across the bridge is back to the beginning all right all right we're chilling we're chilling yo Pissimian, what's good let's go Pissimian. pikachu spawn we got tangela as well i'm gonna loop around this way i believe 
But can you leave me alone? He is sick, though. Is that Skullpede, right? Or... I know Venipede's one of the evolutions. Is this the way I want to go? Hold up. I'll be back a little again. This is not the way I want to go, right? Oh, no. This is the way I want to go. Lugan! Get over here! We're over here! <laughs> oh, my God. How did I get lost in this forest? Embarrassing. It's embarrassing. It's all right. Jeans is still here rocking out. We got it done, though. Come here. I think I got to find Appwin now. Was he saying something about that? Yo, look. Come on. We found it. We did it. So do I have to find Appwin and Appleton? That'll be hilarious. Did I do it? Let me just talk to Hop. There we go. Talk to Hop. Trigger the cutscene. Now we're looking good. Patil and Lil Gant is back. Finally, Jeans, you found Lil Gant. Yes, sir, I did. Because I'm the best ever. Aw, look at him. <laughs> Lily. Tilil. <laughs> That's adorable. That is adorable. Let's get it. We got mommy and her little son or daughter back together. And I remember he was talking about something with Appwin, so I'm guessing we have to help out with Appwin. But I thought we came here to help out with uh, Max Elixirs, or find Max Soups. That's what I thought we came here for, but I guess we came here to uh, help out Pokemans. You know what I'm saying? But well, there we go. See you later, little Pokemon. Have to have your fun life. Have your fun life. I was waving goodbye. Now what do we have to do? Nice one, jeans. Now that we got some nectar, okay, from Lilaganth. Now what do we need? Slurp. I definitely want to call it very sicky. It was pretty watery. I don't think it's what we need, mate, but at least we did a good deed anyway. Come on, let's give Appwin's ne Nectar another, or the next try. Okay, so now we have to find Appwin, which I'm probably just going to have to head that way towards the tree. And go find Apple. Let's go. Let's go. This hop went all the way this way, so now I got to find him. Is he on the map? I'm just going to keep traveling this way, because I feel like we should see him soon. Hmm. Where you at, Hop? Hop just, like, took off. He was gone. He just started running as fast again. And here's Applin. Okay, that's cool. Hello, Applin. What's up, little buddy? Look at this little thing. It's just an apple with, like, a worm in it. It's hilarious. I love Applin and Appleton and Flapple. They're all cool. There is Applin. Okay. Guess we have to find Appleton or Flapple. Yo, we rolling. He rolling, rolling. <laughs> this boy all the way up that way. Oh, he went in a tree. I saw him in a tree. I know exactly where he's at. Ready? If you look up at the tree, see him? He's up in the tree. That hunk of junk. Come here. Don't make me shake the tree down. Yeah, I knew I saw you, little boy. <laughs> oh, something's wrong with that berry tree. Come on. We know you're in here. Let's shake it down. Or she's going to come falling down. There he is. Hey, buddy. I don't know why I have to go through all this. Like, is there really a point for me to chase down these Pokemon for no reason? Let's go. Okay. So he drinks the nectar real quick from Applin. I guess we do not need to find Appleton or Flapple. And what's he say? What's what's Hop say? Logan's nectar wasn't it. Applin's nectar wasn't it. They weren't very sticky enough. Come to think of it, are they really honey at all? Okay, so we're looking for like a honey or something. Like the G Max Urshifu. <gasps> it's probably this boy. It's gotta be this boy. Yeah. So that is what Hop's doing. I guess he's trying to make a max uh a max mushroom or max soup in order to uh give it to Urshifu. So we can get a G Max form of it. Cheap Pokemon. That'd be Wooloo. The Beehive Pokemon. Okay. Oh, no. I think we have to go to the Honeycomb Island. Okay, I know exactly where that's at. So we have to go to the Honeycomb Island right now in order to get that good old honey. Hello, Pikachu. I'm going to go to the town map and make things easier just so I can fly out and go from there. But, yeah. Here we go. We got to go to the Honey... What is that? Honeycomb Island? That's pretty simple. I'll just fly to the Tower of Waters where we evolved in the last episode and I believe I just need to fly over to the left side it's right there yes sir there it is let's get it let's get it if you guys haven't gotten the bike upgrade yet just talk to the person right outside the dojo and they'll give you the faster bike and all that good stuff but yo we got Sharpedo's chasing me down get out of my face leave me alone the thing I got this faster bike if you do not have the faster bike you can't really out uh, speed these guys they're still a little bit faster but you can uh, get ahead on them so there's combis and all that. I'm going to go talk to Hop right here because I made our way over to this island. What's goody, big dog? This has got to be where we get the nectar. I've seen loads of combi around, but no sign of Best Queen so far. But they're the ones that have the sticky honey. Yeah, yo, just talk to the combis. Borrowed a power spot detector from Sonya, but that's why it's going off now. Where is Vespa Queen? Is she up in a tree? It's reacting to that tree. So I guess the tree has all the nectar, getting all the bees, the combis, and all that. Do I go up to the tree or something? There's a cloying smell of thick, rich honey coming from the top of the tree. Will you shake it? Heck yeah. Heck yeah, shake that tree. I want all that honey. 
Yo, I hope like a thousand combis come out. Come on, shake it with your martial arts outfit. Oh, dude, how are you shaking that big tree? What you mean? Oh, what's coming out here? Swarm of bees? What the heck is that? Huh? What? What's going on? Okay, so something came out of a Pokemon den. Was it a Vespa Queen? Was this considered a... Okay, this was considered a den. I guess we gotta kill it. And it is Vespa Queen. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty dope. Is it a 1v1? Yeah, it's a 1v1. Urshifu, get out there. I wish I could have swapped Pokemon. I wouldn't have used Urshifu. You don't get pressured up on here. And our Dynamax band is glowing. It is glowing. And I, do I have a G-Max move? I do not have a G-Max move. But I'm going to go for a Max Airstream. And because it is super effective, we can do some nice damage to it. Let's get it. I think if we die, we're dead. But I don't know how strong this Vespa Queen is. Consider we're level 75. Like, come on. I would have definitely rather use my, my like, Dragapult or something. And just absolutely tee off. But there we go. So we're trying to get Max Soup in order to uh, get a G-Max form for Urshifu. Which is wonderful. Which is just dandy. This is why we do not have a G-Max uh, form yet. So we got to get it some soup and the Nectar is going to help us out. Here goes the Airstream. Yeah, yeet. Do some mean damage and probably a shield is going to pop out here. If I had to guess, right? Do they get shields here? We got a speed boost that we didn't really need. What happens here? No, we, we, that's just how much damage we did. And this thing goes for a Knuckle. We should be able to eat up Knuckles easily. Well, this thing's got... This thing's thick. This thing's thick. Can I give potions while I'm here? I'm going to boost attack, which is kind of scary. Uh, do I go for another airstream? Yeah, airstream's super effective. So I'm just gonna keep dealing damage here. I wonder what happens if we, uh, faint. I'm gonna kinda be mad. There we go, not bad damage. We're just gonna keep rolling out with these airstreams. It won't work, and I feel like this best queen might kill me, unless I can use potions. This thing's an absolute beast. Airstream coming out here. Ooh, that's scary. That's scary. That just KO'd us. What do I do from here? What do I do from here? Just murked on me. Does this mean I can't get the Nectar? No! <laughs> I wonder what's gonna happen. I guess we'll find out. Oh no, we can swap Pokemon. That is just wonderful. That is just wonderful. Give me... Give me Titar. Give me Life Orb Titar. Okay, so we can use our whole party to do this one. That's perfect. That's perfect. Easy enough. I'll take this thing out. We'll set a Sand Stream. And then, if this thing goes for a Max Knuckle, we're totally dead. Titar gets whooped on by fighting types. And I'm just gonna drop a big old Stone Edge. Hit land it. Land it. Bruh, how do you miss? How do you miss? And you missed your Stone Edge. This thing stat changes and uses attack order. Wow. That's some big old damage. This thing gets buffeted by the storm. Let's go for Stone Edge here. Can we maybe land it this time? Yes, sir. And T-Tar just whoops on this thing. T-Tar gets a crit and it's game over. I probably could have one-shot that thing with, with the T-Tar. And just ran it. But yo, GG, best, best queen. You're dead. We get your Nectar. Let's get it. Let's get it. So we get this Nectar now. I believe we can uh, G-Max, which is wonderful. The Aftershock. So the battle calls a strange comb of honey to fall from above. Comb of Max Honey. Let's get it. Oh, look at that. That looks tough. I sure wasn't expecting a Dynamax Vesper Queen to come swooping out and attacking us. Bibbidi bobbidi boobidi bobbidi. Here you go, Hop. Take this Max Honey. This is definitely what you were looking for. Okay. So I believe now we might have to get Max Mushrooms. I believe that's the thing. Let's go see. Let's check out the map. Because if so, I'm just going to fly back to the towers. And this one says, oh no, go back here. Wait, I can't even see this. Head back to the Master Dojo. Easy enough. Easy enough. We'll hit that flight. Takes one second. Look, you, you don't even get like a fly animation. You're just back there instantly. And Gyarados is now in our front spot. Yo, what's good? We make it back to the main dojo with Hop. Welcome back, Wandering Wulu. <laughs> and he, Mustard comes up to us. He smells the max honey. And we are now going to... uh. Make that uh, max soup. So let's get it. So guys, I thought we were making max soup for Urshifu. But we walk into the dojo and Mustard's like, yo, you're ready for the final battle. So I guess that is our reward. Is to actually get the G-Max Urshifu after we defeat Master Mustard over here in his serious final form. So our team is stacked up. We're going to be able to run things. I'm going to lead Urshifu though. And uh, try to show off a little bit of him with his surgeon strikes and everything. He's level 75. But I heard Mustard's an absolute beast, so he probably has really high-level Pokemon. We will check it out in a second, because he did have that level 70 Cub Fu. So I guess we'll see how strong he really is. But like I said, I got my level 100 Exegel, T-Tar, Gyarados, who else? The Dragapult and the Lucario alongside with my Urshfu. But this is the final battle for the DLC, which is pretty dope. Which is pretty dope. Let's get things going. This is the most fun time 
in the world. What's good, Master Mustard? What you want? It's not, oh, yo, oh, ooh, dude, this dude's nasty. Dojo Master Mustard. Yo, I love his name, Mustard. He's gonna throw out my show right here, which is probably a very high level. Well, let's see what happens. He's definitely not gonna Dynamax, so I'm just gonna go Surge and Strikes on everything. There goes our Dynamax band. We're ready to go whenever. I wonder what level his Pokemon are on. I wonder what level his Pokemon are on. We will see this in a second. Come on, show it to me. And his final mod has to be Urshifu, right? Okay, so 73, that's not bad. I'm just gonna go for a nice little uh, Surgeon Strike. Actually, these things are fighting. I can just go for a nice little Aerial Ace. I think that's Fake Out. I'm gonna get started with a little bit of damage. Man, yo, here we go. Here we go. I definitely wanna throw some Surgeon Strikes around too. Close combat coming in here. Hey, yo! This thing's defense is down. We should be able to just smack up on this thing. Was that minus one now? Yes, sir. Let's get an Aerial Ace. Yeah. Hey. See you later, yo. Urshfu coming in. Psh, psh. Super effective, no stab, but his defense was down, so I think that's why we picked the KO. Yes, sir, yo. See you later, my food. You're gone. But it's gonna be cool to see all the uh, fighting types that uh, Buster has to bring. Let's see what you got. Uh, no, let's keep our current Pokemon. I didn't even see who was throwing out. Corviknight. Gonna throw out Corviknight. We probably should have swapped. And this thing's unnerved, so no berries for us. I believe you have Corviknight. I guess we'll just go for a Surgeon Strike, get that stab damage. This thing does not outspeed. Urshfu outspeeds it. And we get three shots, three free crits. Stab as well. Doesn't do too, too much damage because this thing is just a really, really bulky up Pokemon. Well, defensively. You guys already know that. Corviknight, solid. Let's get it. Boom. And we're going to do a little bit of damage. And then I think this thing is just going to come in with a, uh, I don't even know, some flying move and take us out, right? Gonna go Brave Bird. Yep. Brave Bird. See you later, Urshfu. Thank you for coming. Now it's time to run it with, uh, do I go pull? Who do I go? Do I go Poltsky? I'm thinking of going, uh, we go T-Tar with the Rock. I'm thinking of just going Gyarados. Gyarados is just so good. With Gary to Gyarados. Look at that. Look at that recoil damage there. Well, I could go Lucario. Everyone knows Lucario's a beast. Extra little T-Tar. I'm gonna go Gyarados. I'm gonna go Gyarados. I can crunch. I can Ice Fang. I got a lot of different, uh, moves to go out here. Let's get it. Got a lot of coverage moves with the Gyarados. Intimidate comes out here. Does not have Mirror Armor. So you used to, uh, seeing Mirror Armor in Ranked. But so we'll go for a waterfall. Get that stab damage and probably just start running things with this Gyarados. See you later, Corviknight. Level 100 Gyarados. Mm. EVs are stacked. Like, he's just he's just a beast. Perfect IVs. This thing's unreal. He's going to send out. I don't even care. Luxray. Oh, my God, yo. I love Luxray. Yo, what's good, Luxray? Intimidate with the Luxray. That is sick. Dude, Luxray is so cool. Somebody please build me a team with Luxray. I will love you forever. I feel like that's going to be big in a uh, competitive because it can learn to intimidate. Not bad damage. And oh, we made him flinch too. That's tough. I think I'm going to switch Pokemon after this because this thing is already minus one on attack. And Luxray gone. He's so cool. He is one of the coolest uh, Sinnoh Pokemon out there. Gen 4. So cool. Everybody had him on the scene. Urshfu gets no experience because he's dead. <laughs> Lycanroc's going to come out here. I'm going to keep current Pokemon to be honest. I was going to swap but Waterfall is going to be super effective. Then I can take it out in one shot. But no lie, if I haven't beaten the game yet, like if I play this right after I beat the game, oh, this thing outspeeds. That's not bad damage. But if I went to the Isle of Armor right after I beat the game, I feel like it would be a pretty big challenge. But since I played this game so much, I, I can just run it easily. But yeah, definitely an awesome challenge, the Isle of Armor. I'm in love with it. I love the Isle of Armor. The story mode was pretty cool. It wasn't too, too long, so it wasn't bad. But I love more so like the new Pokemon that came in here. Let's switch Pokemon. I'm going to go, uh, I'm going to go Lucario. I'm gonna go Lucario. Come on, Lucario. Urshifu's gotta be the final. I should've brought a Mon, uh, Fairy attacking Mon. I'm gonna go, who is this? Oh, Konomo, oh, 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 oh. See you later, Punk. I'm just gonna Brick Break it. Probably take it out. Lucario is just so strong. I don't wanna lower my defense here. Brick Break, yeah, you. Doesn't even take it out. This thing eats, so. And he goes, Clangor is sold to boost up his stats and he might be able to outspeed me here. He might be able to outspeed me, little boy. Cause I think all stats go up. Attack, defense, special attack, special defense, and speed. And he kills him. Oh, no, he doesn't kill himself. But I can just go for a bullet punch. That's night-night. That's night-night. I think Clanger's soul almost takes uh, half your health or somewhat like that. The boost all your stats. It's a really good move if you can set it up. If you can set it up, you can run some things. But here goes his final mod. We're going to keep Lucario out here. And he's going to throw out Urshifu, baby. And he's definitely going to Dynamax him, so I might as well Dynamax my Lucario. Make it all big and cool and i can bulk i can bulk up my defense here even though i'm super effective why don't i just go for close combat i'm just gonna go for close combat i'm not even dynamaxing 
I'm not even Dynamaxing, because I'd rather get that uh, 30 base more power with a close combat and have that stab super effective. It's going to be such big damage here. Let's get it. And he throws out. Is this G-Max form? He does have a G-Max form. Look at that thing. Look at it. <laughs> it looks so cool. I showed it off in my uh, last video when I was doing casual battles with Urshifu. It was so much fun. He's an absolute beast. He can hit, hit through max guards and all that. But close combat's going to come in here. Easy peasy. Wipe it up. Not even... No chance. No chance for that Urshifu. And there we go. We finish up our final battle with Mustard. And finish up this uh, story mode. There you go. That's it. All I know is after you beat the story mode, you get, uh, what's it called? You get to unlock the new little island. It's like a, the crown island. I'll show it to you guys on the map. Maybe we'll go ahead there to finish off this episode. I held absolutely nothing back. Yo, yo dude, thank you so much for giving us a tough battle. Now give us something rewarding because of that. His league card. Whoa. <laughs> so we get his league card. It seems I will have to re redo my training from scratch. Everyone's like, yo, you did it? What you mean, Jeans beat it? Yo, dude, you know Jeans is beating that. He's the best. He's the best. Honey over here. I heard if you give, uh, who is it? You give somebody, like, a million watts or something, you get the battle on or something like that. But Urshifu's talking in the back of my bag. And he come out here and can we uh, G-Max him? Um, Jeans. What's up, Claire? What's good, Claire? I just, well, I guess I should congratulate you. Yeah, you should. You were annoying to me. You were annoying to me. Rat me out and all that in, like, episode one. Bam, ba -dam, bam, But beautiful. So I'm I'm been wondering what's on that island. Someone told me after you beat this, uh what's it called? After you beat this, then uh you unlock that island. So I really do wonder what that island does. Anyway, let's all head back, shall we? Like one big family. Yes, sir. Mustard's the man, dude. Mustard is the man. But there we go. Complete the DLC and we get this little like fade away. We out of here. And are we gonna get credits and stuff? The end. There we go. Beautiful. So we complete the DLC. Once again, I said that again. And now I want to go see if we unlock that island. So guys, this is the little island I'm talking about. This one with the crown right here. And I do not know how to get on it. So I'm going to need your guys' help. If you do know how to get on this island or what it is, let me know in the comment section down below. Because I've been wondering it ever since I got on the Isle of Armor. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. This is probably going to be the finale for the story mode of Isle of Armor. I might make a few more videos on the Isle of Armor, but we're going to be hopping back into the rank ladder. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Peace out, everyone.